Okay, so I'm out in front of my driveway today and I'm gonna fly my drone. Got my DJI Ascendance remote controller, firmware all updated, the Crystal Sky monitors right here, and my drone's on the driveway. The thing I'm excited about testing today is the uh, new firmware release allows for um, point of interest to be flown uh, with the DJI Sendence controller and the Inspire for that matter. So it's going to be pretty cool. I hope you like it. Let's do it. There's a DJI device not activated. Some components of your DJI device are not activated. So I'm just going to try pressing activate. Okay, there it goes. You want to make sure we get the props on. And you got to make sure you get them on right. All right, so let's start this baby up. Let's set it down here. Make sure the lens cover's not on. I've got it all calibrated. It's a pretty nice day. It's kind of humid. A few clouds in the sky, but um, it's pretty clear. Take off. There she's going to go. All right, take off. There she is. Turn her around. All right. This thing handles beautifully. Super, super impressed by his performance. There she goes, up, up and away. That's like 82 feet, 93 feet high. Uh, barely visible on frame. So let's come back down, forward. Let's go back and forth here a couple of times. Okay, go there. Through the frame. And back. Hopefully I don't hit anything. Lots of control. Very fine control. Get it right up in front of the camera here. Hopefully I don't end up on the... famous drone crash videos. There she is. There you go, now you can get a good look.
gets up to speed pretty darn quick. All right, so there's that. Now, I think I'm gonna go uh, bring her back down real quick and uh, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try a P mode, I guess. Uh, do the POI. But I have to figure that out first, so we'll check it out when I come back. 